I love rolling around with big guns. I need freaky arms like a monster. You see the arms are blowing up. Veins are popping out. In my arms growing up, that's my motivation. So you want your arms to look good because you're wearing short sleeve shirts, you're out in the summertime and those are what hang out. You can over train them, you can under train them and, and you've got to find out the balance of what works for you. I'll give everything a try and find out what does work best for you. If you watch Piping Iron, you watch Arnold when he starts doing that concentration curl, you see the pain in his face and you see the arm blowing up, the oh, yeah. veins, and he talks about the pump and a lot of people still to this day don't understand what the pump actually is. You know, a pump is just you have so much burn and, and pain in the muscle that you just can't stand it. But to feel it, they stop because it hurts. Yeah. Well, then you're not getting a pump. You're stopping before the actual workout begins. You know, the workout starts when it starts to hurt. Because that's when you're actually doing something. So for me, I found that, you know, doing lighter weight, higher reps, going for the pump, going for the squeeze, uh, my arms just started blowing up. Now they started going like crazy. Be the best version of you and be a champion. There's two ways to make the muscle grow, you know, tearing the muscle down, having it rebuild, and pushing blood into that muscle, pumping it up, you know, stretching the fascia tissue and constantly pumping oxygen. And I think that muscle blowing up and blowing up is, is teaching the muscle and training the muscle and making the muscle become bigger. 
for arms, for me, the pump method is superior.